All right, the second half of Twilight Masquerade, our English set, is here. I'm like a week late because I was very sick. Uh, anyway, there's, uh, there's some really cool cards in this set. There's a really nice Hatsugiri Gallery card. Okay, so this set features the the masks. I have not played the DLC of Scarlet and Violet. I don't know anything about them other than there is four of them and they are called because I have it written in front of me. Teal Mask, Ogre Pond, Hearth Flame Mask, Ogre Pond, Wellspring Mask, Ogre Pond, and Cornerstone Mask, Ogre Pond. One card we have already acquired through the non-standard pulling method, Chansey EX. I pulled, pulled, traded, for a Chansey EX because there was no reasonable Chansey EX to pull. There is now a Chansey Gallery in this set. There's a plenty of other really cool galleries and stuff and cards within this set. Look at a Volbeat. A Jinx. A, oh, this Timber, Gerda, and Conqueror. Yeah, and this is Gerda. Delibird. And God, I want to go back to Japan. <laughs> That's what that one is. We've got a total of 30 packs here. We've got a Goldeen, Puchiana, Abra. This is one of the new monkeys. I don't know what it's called. Is, it, is this Okie Doki? Hold on, hold on, wait. Now I've got I've got the, the card list up in front of me. This one is Monkey Dory. Yeah, this one's Monkey Dory. And well, it is a monkey. And then we've got a Sand Slash. Okay, so there's 30 packs in each box. And we have two boxes that we're gonna do. The Japanese boxes are quite nice when it comes to sort of just getting your spreader pulls because you're kind of guaranteed a certain amount. Now that there's ace specs in here, you're guaranteed one per box. You are guaranteed three galleries per box. I think four EXs. That is a really nice Alakazam. That's really cool. I really like that art. That's very nice. And a Sunflora. There's a Sunflora gallery too, which is going to be a good one for the ultra rare deck. Um, so yeah, you get a, you're guaranteed with these ones, at least with the ace spec. An ace spec, three galleries, I think four EXs as well as one ultra rare which or super rare secret rare whatever they're called classified as which can either just be a regular full art or an alt art so there's no guarantee of an alt art but hopefully we hit an alt art it'll be in that slot there's also no god packs in this set because it's not a holiday set i know there's a few of you that love uh, the idea of chasing god packs in the japanese sets and boy do i as well but i've only ever been lucky and hit one grookey thwacky Thwacky, yeah, Lewick. Aron. Oh, speaking of Ace spec, there it is. That looks like one of them, what do they call them? Uh, the one wheeled hover bike things. What are they, I don't know what they're called, but that looks really sick. Oh yeah, there's all the masks. I don't have any idea what they are, what they signify. I, I haven't played the games, or that, that far into the games, done the DLC, whatever it is to get to these new Pokemon. What do you think of them? I do think they're kind of cool, but I see them and I'm like, I, I don't know what these mean. A little rusty with a lot of these new Pokemon. By a little, I mean very. Oh, 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 what's that? Terraform, maybe? Sunkern, Palisand, Ducklet. Ooh, oh, we got the uh, the Dragapult, Terraform. I love this one. Look at the little Dreepies. They're so cute. And as always, I say it every time I'm cracking these, but can we just appreciate the quality of Japanese cards? In fact, I may or may not have already cracked a box of these yesterday before I was feeling up to recording because I just really wanted to open something because I hadn't recorded Pokemon in ages and I really wanted to open some packs. And I swear the galleries look a little uh, mildly textured. What's that? That's... Stop peeking. That might be a gallery. We've got a Volbeat. A Luxio, an Abra. Oh, it is a gallery. All right, that's the the Monkey Dory that we got before. Beautiful card. Look at that up in the cherry blossoms. I really want to get the Chansey so I can show you guys. The Chansey is gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pull it, and then I have to take the Chansey EX out of the out of the binder. We go down one spot on the thing. Ooh, Terraform, Terraform or Alt Art. Alt art? Come on, show me alt art, please. Please. We've got Sinist Chi. Sinist T. We've got a Venipede. What are you doing? Sorry, Mo's being my cat, Mo. Very handsome boy, being very adventurous. Actually, you can see him right there. Is he going to be in the shot for the pool? We've got a regular Chansey. 
Oh, it's a regular terraform, but that's cool. That's uh, that's the Wellspring Mask Ogre Pond. Beautiful terraform card. What is this? Is that the Pokemon and that the mask? I don't... We haven't pulled any of the other masks yet. I can't compare. We're going to have to hopefully pull some of the other ones so I can, pe uh, can compare them. Because I have no idea what I'm looking at here. Something about blue cards and holofoil is just... Mwah, it's really nice. Up there with my favorites. Water type holofoils. Oh. Oh. What is that? That's just a regular holofoil. Varum Clefairy. That's the in-between one. Whirlipede. Ooh, what's this one? Is this one Okie Dogie? This one. This one is Okie Dogie. God, I need to have this. Uh, I don't know why I don't have these, uh, the Pokelector thing up normally when I'm ripping Japanese. Because I got no idea what I'm looking at half the time. Come on. I'm going to see another guy. Ooh, there's texture back there. That could be, is that good texture? Lyron. Applin. Come on. Show me something good. Show me an alt art. Litwick. Oh, it is. It's an SIR. And it's the Hearth Flame. Hearth, Hearth Flame Mask Ogre Pond. Oh, look at that. That's sick. Okay, there's the other part. Is that so is that the is that the Pokemon? Is that Ogre Pond? And that's the, the Hearth Flame Mask or something? That's so sick. Look how beautiful that red looks. There's only one. <laughs> one problem with this card pulling this card for me personally and it's that i pulled one from the box that i opened yesterday i pulled the exact same alt art i mean i can't complain because you're not guaranteed an alt art from japanese boxes but i got the same one twice what are the odds beautiful card we hit an alt art from one box i can't believe we hit another alt art that's so good that's so good i generally seem to have pretty good luck with uh with Japanese boxes and the uh, getting the SARs, oh that's a sick Skarmory, Poliwag, Dreepy. Yeah, there's the Chansey Gallery. I did want to pull it, and here we are. Here we have the beautiful cartoon style drawn Chansey Gallery card. Now I'm gonna have to pull this one in English to replace the Chansey EX that I traded for a ye old Gen 3 era Chansey EX for my Ultra Rare Pokedex series. But unfortunately, this one doesn't count because I don't count Japanese cards towards the Ultra Red X. But, beautiful card nonetheless. Alright, so we are still waiting on one more gallery and like two more EXs from this box. I think potentially gold. I don't know how they're seated. A Chime Echo. This one is... Poltergeist. Yeah, Poltergeist. It's not right. Oh, there we go. There's the uh, Half Flame Mask Ogre Pond. Again, just the regular this time. Is every EX a Terraform EX in this set? Because that's three for three that we've gotten so far. Oh no, I'm seeing a Luxray. A... A Blissey. Okay, a Luxray and a Blissey. I guess everything else is a Terraform. But that's kind of cool. I love Terraform EXs. They're beautiful cards. I'm really excited to go to the pre-release of this coming up now. In English. I don't really dabble in playing TCGs much, so to uh, to go out and play with these new cards is pretty cool. But Farfetch'd, Illumines, Puchana, Tatsugiri. Oh, Killer Water looking. That looks sick. That's some wild art there. Should just be one more gallery now, I think. Dragapult, Sandshrew, Palisand. Ooh, te uh, Teal Mask Ogre Pond. Teal? Teal. Teal Mask Ogre Pond. And a Milotic. Show me a gold card too. I haven't pulled a gold card from Japanese in a while. Kadabra, I think we have it here. Poltergeist. Finizen. Oh, the Sunflora. That's a cute one. Very vibrant. Look at them all. Now, we... I'd I mean, we've pulled the alt art from this box. So now we're just on the home stretch with a couple nothings here. Except maybe a gold. There's a possibility. There's maybe a possibility. A Dreepy. An Iron. Willipede. A bug catcher's net and a might yana. The uh I believe the Carmine EX. No, not Carmine EX. What am I on about? The Carmine SAR is the most expensive card in the set. Currently sitting around 200 ish dollars, I believe. So quite a pricey one. One of those ones you pull it and you go. Nice. I'm not gonna use this card, but uh it's uh, worth a pretty penny, so I can sell it and buy more cards. Because that's just what we do. Ducklet. 
Uh, Sandy Gas, maybe. Timber. Take me back to Japan, please. And Ambipom. All right. That's a pretty good wrap-up for the first box, to be honest. Now, what do I want to see in the next one? Alt Arts, please. Alt Arts, gold cards. A gallery in this pack, maybe. Snorunt. Farfetch'd. Illumine. Yeah, the Tatsugiri! <laughs> I said that I wanted to pull this one. Oh, it's so beautiful. I may have pulled it yesterday as well, but I wanted you guys to see it without me just pulling it out of the folder out the back. That's a beautiful card. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I don't know about you guys, but I'm just happy to be here opening packs. Hope you guys are enjoying this. Watching as we uh, rip into packs that we can't understand. Just because we like the pretty cards. Ooh, speaking of pretty cards. Look at that. God, I love this camera. Look at... Look how close I can get the detail on this thing. Don't look at my thumb. <laughs> I need to cut my fingernails. Look at that. What's that? That's not good. Anyway, there's an ice spec in here. Jinx. Kadabra. The Poltergeist. And it's a different one to the one I got just before. Very nice. It's a box. Secret box. Very, very nice. I know what I'm going to have to do. Next time I go back to Japan, I'll take my ice spec cards. I think that'll be a good shout. I'd be able to trade them for packs and shit over there, right? Okay, what have we pulled? We've pulled a gallery and an ace spec. What's next on the menu? I reckon just a regular EX. A fable? Isabel? I'm calling that one Isabel from now on. I don't care what his name is. What was it? Hassel? Oh, that's right. It was the Hoff. Isabel the Hoff. New name. I've decided. Finizen. Chinks. Chimeco, Tatsugiri, Killer Watcher. Wonder if we're gonna have one of those boxes where the uh, the big hits at the bottom of the box. What do I reckon? Two for two SARs, possible. Ooh, what have we got in here? That's a regular EX. That looks like a Blissey, maybe. Sunken Daramaka. Oh no, it's the Luxray. Nice, very nice. That's cool. I'm a big fan of Luxray as well. Is there a, is there a full art Luxray in here? I hope there is. There is. Looks kind of cool. The full art. I wish there was an altar Luxray EX. That would have been sick. I love Luxray from... Uh, can I have the cards, please? Thank you. From uh, Gen 4, naturally. You know, you get it in the early area, but... I was a wee baby. No, I wasn't. How old was I when Diamond and Pearl come out? I was in high school. <laughs> hey, we got another Dragapult EX. Terraform. Very nice. Big soft spot for Luxray and its evolution line. Also because the shiny versions are really cool. They're gold. It was very nice to see them in... Uh, Haldean Fates. Oh, what's this? Okay, that's... We're talking full art texture back here this time. Maybe alt art texture. The full arts don't normally look that good, do they? Please be another alt art. Come on, Shinx. Grookey. Varoom. Ooh, it's not an altar. It's the regular. It's the... This one's Kieran. It's a full art trainer. The full art trainer is often worth more than the full art... No, I think I needed Carmine. Okay, I, I'm uh, quite surprised to see that this one's a $35 to $40 card. This is just a... This isn't even the, uh, the altar. Oh, God, look at the textures through that. That's so nice. I'm pretty sure that's worth more than the altar at Hearth Flame uh, Ogre Pond. But there's our full art for the box. We still have two more galleries waiting for us. And maybe some gold. I wish. Still don't understand what the seeding is on gold. This may be a gallery. This may be a gallery. It is. It's timber. That's a cool card. He's building a house. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah, depth perception has kicked in. He's building a house. There we go. We're wait waiting on one more gallery. One more gallery and two. Two EXs? One EX, maybe? Oh, we got doubled up on the Dreep and the Dragapult. Illumise. Venipede. Oh, Chomako Gallery. Oh, that's a real cute one. Some of these are like, they're going for like an ultra high detail, like, uh, style on some of these, and they look really nice. Like, how's this for like complete opposite ends of the spectrum for art style, right? You've got your. This is not meant to be offensive in any way, but like like the, like a kid's just drawn it with a couple textures and crayons. And then you've got something that almost looks like a 3D render that's just been like flat scaled kind of thing. They both look fantastic, but both very different art styles. Let's see what uh, we got coming up. <clears throat> what have we got coming up? We've got an Abra, a Chansey, a Phantom, an Alakazam. 
and a Tatsugiri. Very good, very good. Very good. Ooh, it's an EX, it's a Terraform. Okay, Clefairy, Dreepy, Volbeat. Ah, oh, double up again. I was hoping for something fresh. Could still have one more EX lurking. Four packs left. Are you guys looking forward to Twilight Masquerade? This set in English? Because I kind of am. I kind of am, I'm not sure. There's a lot of cool cards. I want the Greninja EX alt art that was in Crimson Haze. Not this one, the, the first half that makes up Twilight Masquerade. But outside of that, I'm not... I don't know. There's not a huge amount that I'm overly excited for. Hard to follow on from Temple of Forces too, because that was such a fun set. Can't beat the uh, the dinosaur versions of the um, three legendary dogs. They uh, it took a little while to grow on me. I thought they were ridiculous to start off with, but I love them now. Brute bonnet, and a slow buff. All right, come on, let's see some last pack magic here. Anything, just any singular hit. We got a glimmer, chime echo, poltergeist. Yay! We finished with a hit. We got the Teal Mask Ogre Pond. How fitting that we get the one from the pack art on the final pack. I've, uh, as I've stacked these in my hands, I've realized we're going back to front here. We're going to put the fancy stuff in the front. So, we've got a full art Kieran. We have an old art. Hearth Flame Mask Ogre Pond. Yeah, I did read it right. That's a really cool one. We've got a Monkey Dory. Gallery. A Chansey. Chimeco, Timber, Sunflora, Tatsugiri. Uh, it is called Scoop Up Cyclone. We have Secret Box, both A specs. We've got a Palafin EX, Blissey EX, Luxray EX, Dragapult EX, times two, Hearth Flame Mask Ogre Pond, Teal Mask Ogre Pond, and a Wellspring Mask Ogre Pond times two. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more content. There's going to be plenty more coming. I've got so many video ideas. I've got, like, I genuinely have, like, 10 or 11 videos worth of stuff ready to go. I just need to get around it, making it all happen. You know what it's like. Chuck a like if you liked the video and leave a comment below telling me your favorite part. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.